We're here in Cleveland Brown Stadium for what figures to be another great game. Welcome to this battle between division rivals from the AFC North. Cleveland squares off against Cincinnati. They're lined up for the kickoff, so let's get this game started. In to kick this one off. To start the game. Perry back to return. From the four. Kick and they're ready to go on offense for the first time. One of those matchups here today, John, a great running team against the defense that's had a lot of trouble stopping the run. Their front seven needs to get more aggressive. They need to get the jump on those offensive tackles and force them to get their inside foot back so they can take off in the middle. Johnson, the long back. Looking for room. Russell is there for the tackle at the 41. And that game will get them a fresh set of downs. It was a great run. He saw his blockers create some room for him, and he accelerated right through the hole. First Ball on their own 41. Ball on the 41-yard line. Takes him down at the 47. This is a spot where you want to show the defense that they have to respect the running game. It's second down and four to go. Keep the back. Gets the pass off. Receiver has it. Oh, with the stop. 39 yard line. Johnny has such a quick release when the ball is out before anybody knows what's happened. That makes it hard for him to be sacked and it gives the defenders less time to react. First ball on the 39 yard line. Ball on the 39 yard line. Hey, watch the screen. Looking to run it here. Baxter comes up to make Johnson the play the at the 34-yard line. It's important to pound the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they're going to bend. Ball on the 34-yard line. Ball on the 34-yard line. Let's go. Cleveland lines up with seven guys in the secondary. Get it off. Russell is there on the Johnson stop at the, the 16. The offensive line does its job way. perfectly. But what happened was the defense was bringing extra guys to get to the quarterback. And when it turned out it was a run, the line had already invited the lineman upfield and out of the play. Inside the red zone. Only one man in the backfield. Gets the toss to the right. Davis is there for the tackle at the 12-yard line. Johnson takes the pitch for a gain of three. Let's make it four. So they have 12 yards to go for a touchdown. Watch your eyes. Cleveland comes out in their nickel package. Hands it off. They'll go with a play fake. Gets rid of it. He finds his man. Touchdown, Cincinnati. This is a good play by the offense in the red zone. The wide receiver is going to break away right here and come up with a catch and a touchdown. Good. 
perfect way to start this one off as they move the ball down the field for the touchdown. They came out with a plan on offense and executed it to perfection. Graham looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing. From the five yard line. Now that's a stiff one. It's still early in the game. But you gotta think the coach wants his guys to make a statement by scoring some points in this drive. So they have first and ten here. We split back. Defense, get ready. We're talking about green. Here we go. Pull back hand off. Holland comes up to make the play at the 26-yard line. He was looking for a place to run, but all those places were filled up with guys waiting to tackle him. And a pickup of about two. Ball on their own 26. The Bengals with a four-man front. Gets rid of it. Nearly intercepted. Simmons had his hands on it. He's a pretty good cover linebacker. He can run with most guys, and he gets good position. Then he reads the pass, and he makes his move. But he'll drop a few like that one. There we go, D. Not here, not now. And that's got one deep. You need a rush. Right, back in the shotgun. Rose it. The 40. Jackson takes him down at the 45. Big gain on that play. 19 yards on third down. Cincinnati comes out in a 4-3. Closing in, gets the pass off, and he hits his target. The 20, the 10, touchdown, Cleveland. He gets a great block right here to spring him for the touchdown. I'll tell you, he takes the defender right out of his shoes that time. Just the type of thing that you come to expect from these guys. They do a really good job scripting the plays that they're going to be running. And they do a great job of executing them when they run them. Dawson is just about ready to kick this one away. From the four yard line. Kick Defense looks to rebound yards. after that Carry last effort when they allowed a touchdown. It's first and ten. Start the drive at the 24 yard line. First and ten. Whip, whip, whip. The Bengals come out with three receivers tight. Slips the tackle. A touch up. With the tackles. John, two guys converged on and both missed. If you get into an opponent's backfield, you've got to make the stop.
First and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. Get it up. Keep the throttle down. Johnson, the lone back. Kelly comes in motion. All day, baby. Come on. Not today. Come on. Hands it off to the back. He's brought down behind the line for a short loss. You talk about a sense of knowing where a play is heading. That's just great instinct. Let's go, defense. All right, here we go. Hey, watch the screen. Johnson lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Dropping back. Rowing. Incomplete pass. Spanzevich was the intended receiver on that play. The Browns come out in a nickel package. Gets rid of it. Jumps up. He has it. The country is there for the tackle at the 49. Watch it here. This is a great call on third down to keep this drive alive. They were in a tough spot here. But this is a heck of a throw and catch to pick up that first down. It's second down and a long way to go. They'll go from the I formation. Keep the throttle down. Crosses it right. Can't bring him down. The 40. Ryan Russell stopped him for his third tackle so far. Rudy Johnson continues to assert himself with a running game. First and ten. Only one man in the backfield. At the end of the first quarter, it's not enough. Cleveland, seven. Cincinnati, seven. The team says what size. And we'll start with the second quarter. First Ball on the 33-yard line. Ball on the 33-yard line. Let's go, Dean. Let's go. Johnson, the deep man. Ball, man. With a counterplay, the back breaking free. Russell stops him Johnson, at the 23-yard line. This back loves to hit the defenders when they come close in for the tackle. He sees the hit coming, lowers his shoulder, and then boom, the defender's left lying there in his back. First Eighth ten. play of this drive. Ball on the 23-yard line. Hold the look. Palmer with a man in motion. Hands it off to the back. Baxter with the tackle at the 11 yard line. Three times in a row they've stayed on the ground and they have three first downs to show for it. I'm seeing an awful lot of hands on the hips out there in the defensive side of the ball. This is what having to defend against a solid running attack will do to you. It just kind of wears you down. Watch this. He got it into the end zone on their last red zone drive. He was hit just as he threw. They did a nice job up front with their bull rushes and rips and stunts, forcing adjustments along the offensive line. They have to do a better job getting off the ball and controlling the line of scrimmage. But they're going to have a tough time whenever they drop back to throw. Tenth play of this drive. It's on. Let's go, let's go. Left, left. Come on. Black, 28. Here we go. We like to the counterplay. 
Roy stops him dead at on the, the 11. No, no place to run on that play. Play. And the thing is, when you don't get underneath the defensive line, you're not going to have the leverage that needed to knock them off the ball. And that time, the defense had all the leverage. Ball on the 11-yard line. Out of the gun. Goes to the end zone. Fourth. Touchdown, Bengals. Another touchdown pass gives him two in the game. Graham comes in for the extra point. The extra, the extra point, point attempt is good. good. Solid long drive taking a lot of time off the clock. Yeah, that was some show out there. They're looking good right now. The defense better find a way to plug up those holes. Defense gave up a touchdown the last time. Ball on their own 20. The Bengals come out in a 4-3. To carry it. Simmons comes up to make the play at the 22. When you run the ball in the first half, you're trying to keep the defense on. But if you're only getting gains like that in the second half, then it puts more pressure on your passing game. Ball on their own 22. The Bengals come out with eight guys in the box. He's brought down behind the line for a short miss. The defensive line playing that one perfectly, John. Yeah, they sure did. What the offense was trying to do there was make it appear like it was a pass play and hand the ball off to the back after the defense goes flying by. Third it just nine. didn't happen out there in that ball one. The, hey, look, look. Don't be fooled, man. Hey, the Bengals it. come out in a dive packer with the throw. Jackson is there for the tackle at the 48. They pick up 27 that time on third down. So they have first and 10 here. The Bengals line up at a 4-3. Hand it off. James with the stop. James appears to have sustained an injury and will make his way to the sideline under his own power. It's second down and three to go. The Bengals come out in a 4-3. Stiff arms the defender to the ground. Smith makes the tackle. So on the blitz, they can't get to the ball carrier until it's too late. And when you're blitzing to stop the run, the idea is bringing more guys and the offense can block. We also got to cut off the lanes and gaps that he can use to escape out of the backfield. That just didn't happen here. So we're now about the earlier injury. We're being told that he has been examined and it is felt that he should not return to play in this game. Gets rid of it. He went up there and he got it. Jackson makes the stop. So they're able to pick up another first down. And this offense is clicking. They're making the right calls at the right time. Almost at the two-minute mark now. The Bengals line up at a 4-3. Breaks away from the tackle. Smith is there on the stop at the 18. That was the lack of execution from the offense. 
when the plan is to take it to the outside around the corner, you need to pick up some key blocks. Ball on the 18-yard line. Eighth play of this drive. And we've reached the two-minute mark here in the first half. So they're inside the 20. Need to get a touchdown. Everything you got. Hey, let's go. Drops back. Looks to the end zone. Incomplete pass. Jurevision was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Jackson with the coverage. It's third and long now, and the defense can afford to back off and play it soft. Ninth play of this drive. Keep the throttle down. Cincinnati comes out on a 4-3 defense, and they might have some unfavorable matchups against this five receiver set. Gets his hand up. The defense forced the issue that time, John. The guys up front got good pressure, forcing him to get rid of that one before he wanted to. Phil Dawson comes in for what will be a 35-yard field goal attempt. The kick is good. The key to winning is having your drives get some sort of points for your team. They got it done on that drive. I'm sure they'll think a touchdown for their next one. back and ready to put this one in the air. Booming kick downfield. From the six. Can't bring us down. They were very efficient on their last drive, relying on the running game as they move down the field. And let's see if they go back to the run here. Ball on their own 24. Out of the shotgun. They reached him just as he was throwing. He decided to try and pass it, but he was taking so much heat that it just kind of wobbled out of there. The defense can't afford to take too many gambles by going for a pick when they should just try and knock it down. One mistake can lead to a big play for the offense. Palmer from the shotgun. Drops back. Deep throw. Incomplete as the defender knocks it away. I really like this defense. They're very disciplined, whether it's keeping containment on running plays or following their receiver all the way down the field in pass coverage. Johnson was his intended target. They worry about us coming. Hey, let's go one deep. Watch it! Yeah, you see me. Palmer back in the shotgun. Pressure gets rid of it. In Incomplete in pass. Perry the short arms it and misses his man. Perry ran the short pattern but couldn't pull it in. Larson comes into the game for the punt. Northcutt looks like he's ready for the return. From the 33-yard line. Northcutt returns this one to the 43-yard line. We're guessing they're going to just throw it and do their best to move into scoring range since they don't want to go into the half with the score the way it is. Cincinnati comes out in their nickel package. Dropping back the pass on the first down. The veteran slips in there and gets the sack. Hey, you still got to give him a lot of respect. His moves haven't diminished that much, and he still makes impact play. Here's a no-huddle. It's a good way to keep the defense off balance. Throws it. 
This pass is incomplete. Thurman teed off on him and it forced the ball out before he could make the reception. Yeah, and he's either going to get in there and knock the ball out or he's going to knock someone else out. As they get ready for this third down play, we'll take a look at how they've done today. Cincinnati lines up with seven guys in the secondary. The rush is on. Going long. Incomplete as the defender knocks it away. That is a catch you have to make. The quarterback did a pretty good job getting the ball to his receiver, and he just dropped it. Now here's the punt unit as the defense forces a three and out. They'll spot this one where it went out. We've Ball on their own 24. Clear! Clear! Safety run! No stop, no stop that motor! Palmer scans the defense from the gun. Johnson comes in motion. Dropping back to pass on first down. Throwing. McGinnis is there on the stop at the 47-yard line. That powerful arm brings them a first down this time. Yeah, and you talk about putting some heat on your throws. This guy really let it go. Johnson, the lone back. Palmer sends a man in motion. It's a blitz. Rolls right. Incomplete pass. Taking shots like that will really affect his rhythm with his receiver. If this coach is anything like an he is, he won't be satisfied with the lead. And he'll have his guy throwing to give him a chance at some more points before halftime. Two quarters, two quarters. All right, here we go. It's on. They ain't got nothing. Cleveland comes out in their nickel package. He gets the carry. Nice play fake. Throws it. This one falls incomplete. He had to unload that pass in a hurry. Yeah, he felt those guys closing in and gunning the ball out of there. Third and ten. Ball on the 47 yard. Cleveland comes out with seven in the secondary. Pressure coming. Gets the pass off. Ooh, and nearly picked off. Who was the, the intended receiver on that play? Larson will come in now to punt it away. Northcutt is back to receive this kick. Fair catch called for. Comes in motion. Dropping back to pass on first down. Rolling. North Cup was his intended target. shotgun dropping back under pressure he was drilled as he threw Brady's pressure can really change the way an offense operates they need to keep some extra blockers in either a tight end on the line or a back that can help them out with their protection third and ten ball on the 20 yard line deuce the Bengals come out in a dime package 
Hand it off. The 30. Thurman is there for the tackle at the 37-yard line. Big gain of 17 on third down. First Ball on their own 37. Ball on the 37 yard line. The Bengals with a four man front. No pass on first down. With the pass, and it's complete. Can't pull him down. Williams is there on the stop. Called by the offense. Nice call yeah. going to the yeah. air. That'll move the chain. First down on the play. First and this should be the last play of the hand. 48 yard line. Let's go, beat this. Beat some, do some. Fry back in the shotgun. Watch out. Gets the pass off. Leap to the wide receiver. The Browns call a timeout. They have none remaining. And this should be the last play of the half. on the 39-yard line. Trying something to the left. Broken up. Pass on the carrots. On the defense. On the floor. Williams interferes with the receiver. I think the defender was beaten him. He just decided to grab hold of the receiver. for the attempt. The try is good. At the end of two, the score is 14-13. Bengals. The Browns. 13. Looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. From the seven yard line. Spins away from the top. Both teams have played pretty well so far. It's still anyone's game. Takes over at receiver after the injury to his teammate. Cincinnati goes with a four-man front. Hands it off. Tackle at the 20th. He got in there and made the tackle. His fourth of the game. They might not be busting off big games, but those linemen are really working hard down there. The Bengals come out in a dime package. Closing in, he can't get away. Smith uses his speed to get to the quarterback. Now he's got some great moves, and he combines that with a very quick first step. So they dug themselves into a hole here, a long third down situation. up into the pocket going deep John they dropped everyone back in coverage he just couldn't get it to the open man we also got to give a lot of credit to the guys up front they were outnumbered on the line and they still put on a good pass rush forcing him to throw before he wanted to Sastadil is ready to pump this one away Chapman sets up waiting for the punt this one goes out of bounds. This one hasn't been decided yet. Each of these teams have played fairly well on both sides of the ball. 
So I could see this one getting decided by whoever has the last possession. First, First and ten. Ball on the 38 yard line. Area, area. Watch your eyes. Johnson, the lone back, receives the handle. Thompson stops him on the at run. the 40. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today. It's second down and eight to go. Henry moves in motion. Gets the call. Davis comes up to make the play at the 41. Good play by the linebacker to get into the backfield and stop the play for no game. I'll tell you, that comes from watching a lot of film and knowing the tendencies of the opponent. That was a heck of a play. Third and seven. Great shoot. Stay at home. Cleveland comes out in their nickel package with the pass. And it's complete. Big tackle. He puts everything into that stick. This is good communication between the quarterback and his receiver to keep the chains moving. They know where the first down marker is, and they recognize the type of coverage the defense is playing. The ball is there, and so is the catch. defense filled all the gap. Back was looking for a place to run, but by bringing the run blitz, they took away all the gaps, bringing them down for a loss. Second and 12. Ball on the 46-yard line. In and out, in and out. Left, left. The Browns come out of the nickel pack. Jets the tackle. Dalen McCutcheon is the man to bring him down. That's his third tackle. These guys that can shrug off tackles are great to have in your backfield. Some of these guys are big and they just run over the defender. While other guys wait until the defender commits and they use a move or a juke or a spin to get out of a tackle. Regular. Bridget! Deucer, deucer. Let's go. It's showtime, baby. Set. Black, 36. Hand it off. Big hit on the ball carry. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. There are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. You got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the opening. Ball on the 36 yard line. Go low! Go low! Check it out, baby. Danny, Danny, Danny. The Browns Go come out of the nickel out. package. Go make the play. Throws it. Incomplete. Johnson was the one they were trying to get the ball to. And this is the eighth play of this drive. Perry lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Looking upfield. Davis stops him short of the marker. The ball carrier. Gain of six on the play. So this will be a 48-yard attempt from the 38-yard line. The okay. attempt is good. is good. He's one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one.
it's on its way. From the five. The defense did a great job on the last series, forcing the offense to go three and out. They're having no success running on first down. Which is one reason why they find themselves on the short end of the stick right now. It's hard to have consistent Rolling success without balance. So after that run, we can see how the, the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. Hey, hey, Second and seven. Keep the throttle down. We turn it up. Nothing. They don't get nothing. The backs are lined hey, up in an eye. Brian sends a man in motion. Looking upfield. Dexter Jackson brought him down. That's his fifth tackle of the game. A big part of this guy's running style is to use the blockers to set up his cut. But they were nowhere to be found on that run. Gain of two. The offense has been stepping it up on third down all day. Looking for the long completion. Almost picked off. Good defense and three and out series are the way to keep your defense fresh and resting. Sastadil comes into the game for the punt. Chapman lines up deep for the punt return. And he chooses not to return this one. Fair catch made at the 31-yard line. guy can run with the football yeah, and this fullback can do more than just get out there and lead block give him the ball and watch him rumble ball on their own 39 keep the throttle down dropping back pressure gets rid of it incomplete Good timing, getting in between the ball and the receiver to save what would have been a big game. Third and two. Ball on the 39-yard line. These third downs haven't been much of an obstacle, and it's helped them to take the lead. Receives the handoff. They'll go with a play fake with the throw. This one falls incomplete. It was almost like the defenders were in the huddle on that series. They hit a roadblock with everything they tried. Unable to get anything going on that series, they'll have to punt it away here. And he waves for the fair catch. The Bengals line up in a four three, looking for room. Is there on the stop at the 20 yard line? The defense held their positions and didn't let them get very far. So, at the end of the third quarter, the score is 17 13. Bengals. 
The Browns have the ball to start this fourth quarter and can move into the lead with a touchdown. Second and seven coming up here. The Bengals come out of a nickel package. With a counter play. What a stiff one. Smith is there for the tackle. Drones. Very little help up front. Maybe a yard or two on the play. And here's what they've been able to do so far on third down. Here we go, baby. The backs are lined up in an eye. Pressure coming. Going long. And he can't find a way to keep possession. When you talk about ball control and time of possession, that's not what you want to say. Sastadil will come in now to punt it away. Chapman sets up to run back the punt. He muffs it. The Browns at home. They give it right back to them after the fumble on the punt return. After the fumble recovery, they'll set up shop at the 32-yard line. The Bengals come out in a 4-3. Receives the handoff. Thurman is there on the stop at the 30. Gain of two. It's second down and eight to go. Give it to the halfback. Great thing. Under pressure. The defensive coordinator teaches his guys to be very aggressive out there on defense. He has a lot of confidence in his cornerback, and he's willing to leave them out there in single coverage on an island. So they'll blitz on just about any down, looking for a big play. It's now third and long after the sack. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. Let's go. Be good. Cincinnati comes out in a dime package. Throwing. Nice adjustment. He's taken down at the 22-yard line. He makes his fifth stop of the game on that play. This is a guy who comes to play, and he seems to make big catches when they really need him. This time, they needed to convert on third down, and he's there for the reception and the first down. Steps up, got to him as he throws. When you let the defense get into your backfield that quickly, bad things are going to happen to you. Cincinnati goes with a four-man front. Winslow in motion. Dropping back. With the throw, right on target to the wide receiver. Perfect execution to get this first down. Look at it here. He knows how far they have to move the chain. And he gets it by making the right decision and laying it in there like that. Three. Three, 16. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. The 
Still in this direction. He's brought down behind the line for a short loss. These plays can end up with lost yards if the defense gets through or around their blocking quickly enough. It's third and goal at the five. Check it out, baby. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Pull back hand off. Thornton comes up to make the play at the two-yard line. They're trying to get it in on the ground. The defense says, uh-uh, not this time. Fourth down and goal to go. Come on, now, let's finish this. Let's go. Regular, regular, regular. We're talking about real. Handed off to the back. Touchdown, Brown. I'll tell you, they just knocked that defensive line backwards on that play. Watch it here. The offensive line explodes off the ball. The defense can't get any penetration, and the runner is in the end zone. kind of games you love. The crowd's into it. The coach's brains are in overdrive. The players are all hyped up. Everything that could be switched on is switched on. Yard line. Missed Cincinnati is trying to take the lead on this drive as they take over. So they have first and ten here. First and ten. Johnson goes in motion. It off. Russell is there on the Johnson stop at the 34-yard line. So let's take a look at how this back compares to the opposition. Two-minute warning coming up. Ball on the 34-yard line. Johnson, the long back. With a counterplay. Number 95 stops the play in the backfield. They went backward on that one. And that's a very good call by the defensive coordinator. He had a good idea of what was coming, and he called the perfect play to stop. Almost at the two-minute mark now. Perry, the lone back. Hand it off. Keeping him at bay. Oh, makes the tackle at the 38-yard line. Hey, if you can keep running the ball in the fourth quarter as you're playing catch-up, that's an advantage that you have over the defense because it keeps them off balance. The quarterback's going to be the guy making this thing happen. He should realize that there's still a lot of time left, knowing it's only a field goal they need. As long as he can move them down the field quickly and avoid third and longs, they'll have a chance to at least tie this thing. Kelly, the motion man. They're coming with the blitz. Rowing. Baxter is there on the stop at the 30. The quarterback is calling them back to the line of scrimmage. Receives the handoff. Great fake. Looks to the end zone. And they were each jockeying for position while that one was in the air. Let's get the call. Pass interference on the defense. Number 33. 
If First there hadn't been any interference, it might have been a touchdown. Yeah, but they gave him the ball on the one-yard line, so they're only delaying the inevitable. It's first and goal at the one yard line. You can't stop me. Here we come. Play football. Johnson, the long back. Spindler. He's brought down behind the line for a short pass. He's calling everyone up to the line of scrimmage. Don't stop. Don't stop that motor. Palmer sends a man in motion. Closing in to the end zone. He can't stay in bounds. Good push by the defensive line, forcing the incomplete pass. He hung in there. He didn't really have the time that he needed to make the play. The quarterback has to know who his outlet guy is and get the ball to him when he feels that pressure coming. First it's third and goal at the one. There we go, baby. Rock and roll. Don't make the play. Nice job so far on third down for the offense, and we'll see if that continues here. of time wraps him up and brings Whoa. him down. Makes the the big man gets in there for a big sack. He's got a great combination of size and move. Now, he won't be winning any races, but he's good at getting after the quarterback. And let me tell you, you never want him to be the guy falling on top of you. This Important kick here that can tie it up. here in the fourth and with less than a minute to go they score to knot it up hey there are 60 minutes in every game not 59 and a half they still have some work out there to do if they want to see another point flip today Shane Brand will be kicking off number 16 back to return From the six. Kickoff return 15 yards. They have a reputation for pulling out wins right at the end of the game. They have another chance to do that kind of thing right here with this drive. They may not want to take a chance here because they have a ways to go to get into field goal range. The coach might just call a run and tell the his team to get ready for overtime. At the 21 yard line. First and 10. There we go. Hands it off. Thornton is there on the stop at the 23. The defensive tackle surge through the line to bring the runner down. Ball on their own 23. Ball on 23 yards. One of us will make a play. Not today. Hey, let's go one deep. Hey, let's go. Just a great game to this point, and we head to a fifth period. As we take a look at his success returning kicks, we get ready for the kickoff. Dawson looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. Decent kick. We should have a return. From the six-yard line. Kick Perry is return. able to get it to the 27. Perry on the return. The Bengals will start the drive at the 27-yard line. First and 10. Here we go! Only one man back. Come on! Come on! 19! Proceeds the handoff. 
McGinnis is there for the tackle at the 31-yard line. Johnson takes advantage of a little daylight, picks up three yards. Ball on their own 31. Ball on the 31-yard line. What's the hard count? From the start, from the start. Makes the play at the 31. This is where you got to run a few counters or misdirections to take advantage of this team's aggressive defense. The defense lines up in the nickel. Dropping back, off balance throw. He can't bring it down in bounds. You know, as a receiver, you have to be aware of so many things. Where the first down marker is, where the defenders are, and where the sideline is as you stretch out to make that catch. Johnson was the intended receiver on that play. Good defensive stand there. Now they'll punt it away after a three and out. They'll spot this one where it went out. The Bengals with a four-man front. Hands it off. Thurman is there for the tackle at the 23. Nothing doing that time, John, as the linebacker gets there quickly. He's one of those guys who's a sure tackler. He'll move up and play physically at the line, come on a blitz, and play the run just about as well as anyone on the defense. The Bengals line up in a 4-3. This one will be spotted Rome. at the 26. He's put on a tackle in the clinic so far. He now has eight in the game. Third Ball on their own 26. Ball on the 26-yard line. Let's go. Fry spreads them out. Pressure. They reached him just as he was thrown. I'll tell you, the defense made a great stand right there. On the play. Sastadil is ready to pump this one away. Chapman back to return. From the 34, spins away from the tackle. Chad doesn't have a whole lot of room to work with, getting it to the 43-yard line. The ball on their own 43. The drive at the 43-yard line. First and 10. Cleveland comes out with their nickel pack. Touching comes up to make the play at the 43. Now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. Ball on their own 43. Ball on the 43 yard line. Watch the snap now. They'll go from the I formation. Tucks it away. Davis is there on the stop Johnson at the 49. Johnson runs it through the middle gain of about six. Ball right around midfield. Ball on the 49 yard line. Cleveland comes out in their nickel package with the throw. This one falls incomplete. A little bit long, overthrowing the receiver. That might have had something to do with his follow-through. If you release the pass just a little late, you're going to see underthrows or balls thrown into the ground. If you release it too early, then you'll see an overthrow like that. Very solid defensive effort to force the three and out. And he 
signals for the fair catch. Ball on their own 20. Cincinnati comes out with eight guys. This one is spotted at the 20. And he scores his third tackle of the game. One yard. Rome takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Let's go. Hey, hey, hey. They ain't got nothing. Play football. Cincinnati lines up in a 4-3. They go with the draw. Williams comes up to make the play at the 20-yard line. I'll tell you, if you want to run outside the tackles, you have to seal off the inside and kick out the outside to have some kind of hole to run through. That just didn't happen on that play. Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20-yard line. Ain't no way. Make them come to the Cincinnati comes out of the quarter defense. Throws it. Incomplete as the defender knocks it away. He put the ball exactly where you want to put it. Sastadil comes into the game for the punt. Chapman is the deep return man. And so the punt goes out of bounds. First and ten. Cleveland comes out in their nickel package. Number 95 makes the tackle. Johnson had some room to work with on the outside. Gains six yards. He's trying to hurry them back to the line. Pressure coming. Incomplete. And this guy is so strong, he was able to get that pass away. With a man in motion. On the carry. William again. Makes the stop and they'll be short of the marker. Cincinnati comes up empty on another third down attempt. Their eighth such failure. Northcutt will go back to accept this punt. This one goes out of bounds. Cincinnati looks like they're playing the pass as they're lined up in the dime. There he goes. Ball loose. The Bengals scoop up the fumble. Terrible ball handling, and the defense recovers here in overtime. So it's first and ten following the fumble. Only one man back. We hand it off. We'll feel that one tomorrow. Johnson takes it up the middle for a yard or two. It's second down and nine to go. It's the call. Number 95 comes up to make the play at the 33-yard line. Johnson takes it up the middle for a yard or two. 
So the third down, they need to get it to the 26 to convert. The Browns come out of a nickel pack. He tucks it away. Davis is there on the stop. One Linebacker came up and made a very solid tackle to make sure he didn't get to the first down marker. The biggest play of the game to win the game. Shane Ray bangs it through, and, and that'll do it. The game-winning kick in overtime. The final score is Cincinnati 23, Cleveland 20. 23, Cleveland 20. This is Al Michaels with John Madden saying goodbye for EA Sports.